Hi, this is Simple Card Monday and it's Happy Happy Joy Joy with Christmas with the Cricut blog. Today I've made this simple joyful card. It's very, very simple because with the double sided paper, you really only have to cut two things of paper to make this. How simple is that? And I cut out this cute little house from Joys of the Season. And so let's go ahead and get started making this. I think you'll have a lot of fun with it. Okay, let's get started with our simple card. It's a joyful card, and I just wanna show you guys how simple this is, especially when you go ahead and use double-sided paper. Eliminates cutting out a lot of extra little pieces. So, a couple things about this joyful card. You need a piece that's three inches by eight inches, and we're just scoring it at four inches and folding in half. Double-sided again, you wanna go with it because it's the way. You need a piece that's four and a quarter by eight and a half. And then I scored three inches from the left end. You can see here, unfolded it. And the card goes together just like this. Couldn't be any easier, could it? I mean, look at this, done. Isn't that awesome? Okay, and to hold down our little flap, I went ahead and I punched out this Joy to the World of course, that was no accident that I chose that. But that's from the Close to My Heart set called Just for the Holidays. That's available this season, brand new, I believe. And I punched it using a Stampin' Up! 1 and 3 8 inch punch, because that seems to work perfect. And then I went ahead and I punched my favorite, you guys know, the glitter paper. I know, always with the glitter paper, but it's so Christmassy. I punched this with the Stampin' Up! 1 and 5 8 inch um, scallop punch, which I think is their main scallop punch. And I'm going to go ahead and layer those, and that's going to hold the card flap down. It's just going to be in that little corner there. And then finally, I went ahead and I cut this house out at two, I want to say, I'm sorry, I cut this house out, out at three inches. And this is on Joys of the Season. I layered it a number of times, um, and I thought this this red swirly, it's like a velvet paper from SEI, so gorgeous. This SEI line this year, this Christmas mint is just fantastic and um, went ahead and layered that. So let's get started with assembly. First, we're going to ink. Now it's time to cuddle bug, and I'm just gonna cuddle bug one little section here, that top section, and not. I'm gonna leave this tail hanging out. I'm using an A plate, which is the big white plate, and then I sandwich it between two B plates. Cuddle bugging is addictive. Let me just tell you that in a big hurry. I'm also using the snowflake folder, and um, there's some exciting news coming out with some cuddle bug folders for Christmas, so stay tuned for that, because I think you're gonna be real excited. Now for some ribbon, I have this Anna Griffin little ribbon. I think it's so pretty. It just adds a little something something to here. And I'm gonna go ahead and put that on. Just a little something to mimic the design I have in the bigger paper. And we'll see how close I cut this. I think I cut it pretty close, but we'll see. Yeah, pretty good, pretty good. And there's that. So here's our card, finally made. Um, wanted to go ahead and remind you guys to sign up and leave some comments this week on all our posts on Christmas with the Cricut, and that's www.cricutchristmas.blogspot.com to be eligible to win a real big prize this week from Hallmark Scrapbook, which is two cartridges of your choice. That's huge. Um, the Jubilee cartridge a package of paper from Coordinations, and then a package of paper of this gorgeous, luscious SEI paper, which frankly you have to have. I'm telling you, it is awesome. So have a great week and talk to you later. Mm -hmm.